so sorry. Hello guys, welcome back. Now you gotta watch my guy. It's such a weirdo. I don't know what's going on with him. It's like he's on something. But anyway, how are you all doing today? I hope everything is fine. And uh, I'm glad you are here to have some fun with me on Red Dead Redemption 2. In the last episode we finished with a major shootout and uh, because I wanted to loot all the bodies I ended it right there. So the looting is all done and we are ready to go on with the mission. So here we go guys. Good work boys. Now let's tear this place apart. <clears throat> Bill, you go search that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. Uh, I was thinking I, I was about to find something special, but nah. Just another way in. That simple. What is this? Nothing. Okay then. So this is the barn we have to check out, clean out. Not even up here. That's disappointing. I really thought there would be something up here. Something good. Something of value. Just something. So disappointing. How do I get down? There we go. Okay. Medicine. Cabinet. Okay, I cannot carry any more of these items. I guess we can use one. Better than, than leave it behind, I guess. That way my life is back to full. Uh, which one is it? This one? Yeah. I hope. Oh, I took the wrong one. That sucks. Eh, doesn't matter. I'm already full of items, so I think we're gonna be getting them enough. This one. Yeah. Ooh, delicious. There we go. What else is here? So, the boss man, the leader, wants to do a train heist. He wants money to buy a little of a better life. That simple. But, uh, these guys that we just killed pretty much uh, we did it because they were planning a train heist as well so why not kill them and take their plans and their stuff so I guess we gotta find something here to do with the train heist maybe inside this box maybe not there's some stuff but some cigarettes 
second strawberries. That can be good. Oh, here, dynamite. It's gonna be this one. Let's first take the stuff. Okay, full of cigars. Full of... What is the other thing? Nothing. Just a cigar, okay. What does a cigar do? Damage stamina restores dead eye. Yeah. Nothing to gain with using one at this point. Here. This looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. <laughs> Smells good. Come on. Napalm in the morning. Did we get everything? Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. All right. Let's get out of here. Proud of you boys. Oh. Uh, yeah, we're Not finished here, down. I guess. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving guys. Out of my way, please. Come into it. Hard as they like. But we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws for life, fellas. Outlaws. Wait until we have John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us. And I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get comb, but this hit will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> Yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. I'm a poor lonesome cowboy. Hey, you see that fella? Wasn't he at the camp with Cone? Leave him to me. All right, we're heading back. Just bring him back oh, yeah. alive. He could be useful. Okay, you got Let's it. Get him, Joe. She's down. A lasso. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Down to lasso. Oh, Driscoll. Uh. Come on, horsey. Gotcha. Keep uh, to halt and dismount. Okay, easy enough. Press a uh, circle near Odrisco. Oh, here, piggy, Just piggy, piggy. Go, come on. You're my piggy now. Squeal like a piggy. Okay. Oh, loot him, of course. Why shouldn't we? You're not gonna need it, man. It's mine now. Oh, a big buck, big buck and a bit. Come on, I, I, I'm nobody, Mister. Now on the horse you go. Oh God, no! He just throws him up. <laughs> He's that strong. He's a man's man. What's your name, boy? He throws I mans know. around. You don't know your name? It's Kieran. Kieran what? Uh, Duffy, Kieran. What way is it? Duffy. 
Nope. This one. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No! Please! Oh. That's new. I just saw the the button combination on top. Please, mister. I didn't catch what it does. I didn't read it. Didn't have the time. I'm begging you. You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it for you. I gotta say, I don't looks know nothing really beautiful. real about him, honest. Oh, God, please, no. Are you trying to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay? Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay, okay. That's two bones right there. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. Break them both. Uh, are we there yet? Am I going the wrong way? No, I'm not. Man, how far did we go? Oh, we're there. Started to think that's not normal. Home, sweet home. Wait, is this home? I don't even know. But it's home for now. You sack of shit. You sack Let's of shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. Smells like it as well. Okay. You're coming with me. Don't hurt me, please. No, oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Not really though. Maybe a little bit. Huh. You found a little shit, did you? Yeah. Lucy I got him. Brought Very a gift. Good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. You want me to make him talk? Oh no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle! Mr. Williamson! Tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son! Lies! Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on coal. Well, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. It's a new day. Mission complete, old friend. Hold button for details. Oh, that's not very good. I got the headshots though. But uh, if it's like the other games that Rockstar makes, we should be able to replay those if we want to, to get the, the golden achievement, I guess. Hmm. 
but uh, that's not gonna be for now. That's maybe for off camera. Okay, let's see the map. Yeah, this is the other mission here in town. I was thinking maybe to do a little exploring, but I think now in the beginning we can better stick with the story so we get everything and learn everything that we have to, and then we can do what we want. Okay, so should be here. Okay. Yeah, the first one, so okay. Let's pay a visit to Mr. B, Mr. P. Starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. Pearson. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. Unfortunately. <laughs> when we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough, enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted off. Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't what? go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if there's game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. <coughs> Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. Come on, this way. What the hell was that disgusting food you gave me? Where is it? A sordid, salted offal. What the hell is that? Slightly restores health core and dead eye core. Eh, I guess we can taste it. He can. We do not, so we do not care. How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay, apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. I uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill that ain't no Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way, find some higher ground. Gia! Been a wild few days, all right. That right north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, going out for John, that thing with the old Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that, just a lot to think back on. 
I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. <laughs> well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. We're going hunting, guys! Oh yeah, baby! It's a hunting trip! Man, looks so gorgeous! Even though it's a lot of white, So I tried the ground uncovered here. I tried to pet my horse before way. and I couldn't. It was so weird. <laughs> Whatever I did, it was not working. The winds died down too. I had to No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. No shh. I had quiet. to replace my horse and then it worked. So that's pretty much the only glitch hey, that I found in the game so far. There's deer been here recently. How can you tell? Can you uh, tell? the tracks, duh. Let's walk it from here. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. A gun will scare everything around. That's something that I'm gonna have to pay attention to because I'm gonna forget. I'm sure of it. Yeah, just Come a sec, dude. Sure, why not? What is this? Just a hand. Knife. A lantern. Ooh. Not something we can use right now, but... And a rope, of course. Keep down. Move quietly and slowly. Ooh. This is the real thing. You see the tracks? I uh, think so. Maybe not. Focus. It's right here, dude. Tracks. Are you blind? Oh, yeah. Ooh, nice. That makes it a lot easier. Focus on the track. Sure, why not? easier in the snow, but once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. Yeah, here in the snow for me, no problem, but I guess if there's no snow, it's not gonna be the same story. I think I see them right there. See one. Shh. Down there. You see them? I know. Are you ready with that bow? Aim for their head or neck. We want a good, clean kill. Get good tension on the string before releasing. Just don't overdo it. Don't overdo it. Take the shot. Nice. 
Wow! First shot! I got lucky. There's another one, at least a track. There's also two more on the other side. Ooh, that has to be cold. I think something is getting a lot smaller right now. There they are, beautiful animals, but hey, we gotta eat, so. So close, not in real life, no way. Uh, call is square. Okay. How do you st study as well? Doesn't do anything. Take a better position for the headshot. There we go. Oh, it's not dead. We should go finish it off. Careful. This might be our only chance for a good meal. Oh man, poor thing. It's screaming from pain. Man. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm happy it's not real life because I would go. No way I can do that. You hear it screaming? Man. That sounds. If I hear that in real life, that scream from uh, absolute pain, I never forget. I have dreams about it, or nightmares, better said. Come here, horse. Oh yeah, he's coming. Hey buddy buddy I'm gonna call you white socks Let's go home with the food. Guy's gonna be happy. Where is our pal? Oh, there he is. What's that sound? It's 
starting to hear things guys it's not a good sign ready to head back when you are come on then let's head back Nice work, Arthur. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> You've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. Notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding the old Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. <laughs> The girl, she has a wild look in her eye. <sighs> of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with your Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Yeah, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Whoa. Let's see if we can find another way around. Big guy. You must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. Well, he's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. Where did he go? Oh, there he is. If you... Shoot in the air. Off the trail. He will run away, right? So, why yeah, not do yeah. that? Don't have to kill him to scare him away. We ain't ever talked that much, you and me. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that? But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... know you could run it alone. No problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh yes, Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. I 
And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh. 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. <laughs> Taught me to read. John, too. Taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. <laughs> So here we are guys, once again at the end of the episode. And I don't know what's going on today with the facial expression but he's acting really weird today. Anyway, I hope you had some fun watching today's episode where we first went after a guy and took him hostage because he escaped and we cannot have that. And after that we went to hunt a couple of deer because the guys are hungry and there's almost no food. So this should keep them heavy for a while. Now I want to thank you all for watching. Now go have fun and until the next time.